Okay, guys. In last video, um, there was application of ACG bridge rectifier and multiplier. And this video will be more general. So just to remind again uh, what, what is ACG bridge. And generally, it is a symmetric charge uh, exchanger, but with some reason we gave that name as asymmetric current generator. No matter. Um, again, um, in capacitor bank or battery, we, when it's uh, connected to uh, AC input or uh, push-pull, uh, capacitor or battery uh, will give one amount of charge and receive much more, depends what kind of uh, AC, um, ACG unit we are using. ACG could be with two, with, um, actually it is voltage divider, uh, so divide with two, with three, with any number. Uh, so if it with two, then a capacitor C3 will give one amount of charge and receive four. Three will be extra. With uh, three uh, SGG with three, uh, then we'll give one amount and receive back nine. Uh, and eight is extra. So it goes like this. So uh, we have, let's say it is ACG with three, with four, with seven, simply the simplest with two and with this one with many and those two I will explain later uh, so let's check now I'm using uh, 8 volts uh, 8 volts uh, 50 hertz input and I will use uh, ACG with two will charge this capacitor tank so you can see it's go very nice let's stop there in this discharge but it is about 33 32 so eight four times um, if you want to uh, if you want to make application so for this one which goes to 30 with 8 volts which goes to 32 don't load with 12 volts with 15 volts it will not be effective efficient so go close to the maximum not exactly to the maximum but close to the maximum okay so this now i will use tests with 3 acg with divided with three voltage divider and let's go now so it goes about 20 uh, okay let's discharge again i will show now with four uh, but it will not be too much because Eight divided with four minus voltage for diodes will not be too much effective, but be interesting for something else. Okay, let's discharge. Okay, it goes about ten. Uh, not much, but it's uh, predictable. But if you if you use a uh, 12 volt battery to charge another 12 volt battery, then uh, this one will be very good. Uh, so it will add to over 14 volts. So by this you can ch uh, charge another the same level of 12 volts battery. Okay, let's stop this again. And discharge so so how I continue uh, there will less gain in the voltage in this um, bridge 
can we get more of course we can get more but we will change approach okay have a look at this uh, um, image too so it is basic acg where there are two additional so if you can make like this so see there, there are two additional and let's see what i will uh, get so over here is capacitance is um, let's say when a capacitor tank will give one will get back about uh, uh, 1.2 so, so less than and see where it goes okay oh sorry <laughs> i didn't disconnect uh, okay now i will take now it's more likely it goes too much and i will stop here just to be on safe side <laughs> have a look bulb okay so but we can continue with this one uh, let's say if you take this one and make another th the same and then uh, so let's say over here it is that one that one and plus another acg it is something like this so see they have um, three packet uh, two the same and plus in the middle then if you want to continue more then we make the same like this one and in let's say it here and here in, in between will be another so it will uh, uh, increase more voltage uh, okay it is for exactly that one which we use for a three phase uh, so for e-bike uh, or e-scooter or any you can uh, so on the three phase and then you can uh, get uh, uh, loads some devices on higher voltage than input is so with uh, 24 with 24 uh, e-bike uh, then easy you can drive uh, to 220 uh, uh, device basically it is that for now i will put some diagrams uh, on the description section which you can download free thank you bye